And off we go. Dimwit out of the gates first. Uh, good level 8. What I'm seeing on Dimwit's board is he's got a, a three-row stack of, of viruses he's really got to take care of. Uh, has a little bit of a doubles delight down in that corner. Meanwhile, Influx uh, has uh, a, just cleared out a, a glut of viruses. Uh, his issue is really going to be... Uh, I, I'm really trying to find a flaw on this board, and I'm, I'm having difficulty finding one. This is a solid, solid 8, and he could do some work. But a bit of a quick misplay... Uh, we'll see what happens there on Influx's side. But Dimwit firing off a big combo down to 26. It's a two-virus game between the one and the nine seed. Looks like he might have tried to go for a like a like a horizontal play or like try to tuck underneath on that red in column five. But he realized, oh, crap. Oh, shoot. I don't have the uh, pieces I need for it. So he kind of abandoned ship on that. Absolutely, uh, as it is a big lead here for Influx, almost double, actually more than double digits, uh, as it looks to be another uh, zero drop clear. We're seeing just absolutely quick, efficient play, uh, just a lot of down pressing, uh, making sure everything goes in, and Influx playing high speed as well. Uh, he's down to three. Dimwit struggling here to get out of uh, double digits and into single digits. Uh He's uh, a little bit log jammed as well in column five, Ethan. Yeah, he's trying to set things up, but just isn't getting the right pieces to knock out those combos. Might get a little something here. I mean, starting to get things a little going here, but he's he's needs reds in the worst way. Influx out at right around the ninety second mark, so uh, holding on to a big lead here. But uh, we know Dimwit, and uh, he he definitely plays very very well from behind. He is yeah, currently. He does six viruses to go here electing to go uh for i think this tuck double here he's going to set up a combo i like this combo uh, he's going to get three viruses out of that uh and now pretty much free and clear he's going to have to uh combo out and that's exactly what he's going to do out at 213 uh not not the fastest uh eight from dimwit but uh, we'll see what he does here is he has a, a very double friendly uh level nine yeah, it's a very friendly nine. Has a good amount of variety to it. Looks like he's going for the horizontal clear for those yellows. He's got... Just looks like he's waiting for a yellow-blue to kind of help things along here, but not popping up. There it is. And now he's... Oh, and he gets the double yellow. Here it comes! Big clear there. 28 viruses to go for Dimwit. 12 to go for Influx, as he is just absolutely going to town on this board. Uh, he has set himself up with a little bit of garbage. He can work around that horizontally out in row number one, and that looks to be the plan as uh, Influx is now clearing out column number six with that big clear down to eight viruses. It's a 10-virus game uh, in favor of Influx. Yeah, Influx doing a great job. Looks like he's going to hold off real well for this uh, going into level 10. Looks like he's waiting for a few more pieces to pop his way. He's going to get a combo here. Yeah, it looks like he's going to have to try to take out that blue the old-fashioned way. He's going to have to go vertically on that. And I think Dimwit holding out for a red-yellow, and he's going to get it right there. Uh, and then we'll have another double. But Influx out at three and a half minutes. Uh, but Dimwit uh, has made a very, very strong case here uh, to keep this going in level number, no level number nine. Yeah, he's looking very well here. I remember... Uh, look, he, a good finish here just needs to clear out that blue on the right side and he'll be able to take care of that yellow and, and remember uh these players playing now levels 8 to 11 so a little bit more strategy involved uh about uh 40 to 50 more viruses that they will need to clear as uh dimwit's out at a 402 and it is an eight virus game uh double friendly if dimwit can get down into that down and dirty into that board uh we're seeing influx with a big glut of yellow in the bottom half of his board uh, and not really much in the way of red. Only a handful of reds he's got access to. So, of course, he's getting red. Yeah, needs to avoid those reds right now. Um, probably going to want to do something to take care of those yellows as soon as possible. He's, he's, he's got that big staircase. Looks like he might go for a uh, go for a T if he can get it. But that would require a double yellow. There it is. Oh, but he's going to get a combo here. Nice. Dimwit down to uh, 29 viruses, uh, looking to catch up to the 9 seed here as he is behind early, the defending speed champion. Uh, 
currently behind here in round two after a pretty quick uh, match against Dave Smith says. Uh, Dimwit is now up against Influx, and I believe uh, these two have faced each other before. Uh, I'm just going to check that. But uh, 18 to 14 here is Dimwit starting to catch up, Ethan. Yeah, and uh, and you are correct there. Uh, Dimwit did face Influx before, and Influx defeated Dimwit uh, three games to none in the semifinals. Uh, that was the time uh, Dimwit was a 16 seed. So this is within the realm of possibility of Influx pulling the upset here. And as we know, uh, players uh, seeding in this championship uh, was decided by how they finished in previous tournaments throughout the year. Uh, Influx locked himself the nine seed up as he's out at 547 on the, the final level. Dimwit only three viruses behind. Uh, he's going to get that tuck clear and he's going to be out at a 557. So very, very close here. Only a couple of viruses between our players and a very double friendly board for Dimwit. This could be a problem for Influx. Yeah, this is a very friendly board. He's going to get a lot of twos, a lot of threes. We're, hopefully he'll be able to put together a couple of fours, but we'll see if what he can do with it. Going to get that horizontal cross drop there. Uh, it is now a virus lead for Dimwit, uh, but it looks like these timers might be just a touch apart, but big combo there by Dimwit. Now down to 26, really starting to uh, pull away as it is uh, six and a half minutes now for both players. And Ethan uh, Dimwit is looking to uh, put this one away. Yeah, he's uh, tied for it right now, holding on to a very slight lead. So it's still very, very close right now. Oh, looking to get across. He gets the sweet T. Puts him into 17 now. 16 to 19 here. Now 15 to 19. Dimwit has a horizontal triple. Pretty much he can take at his leisure. He's going to take it now. And he's really gonna make. He's gonna. He's gonna have to consider going from uh, the ground up here uh, to start clearing some stuff. Although uh, it looks like he's going to get that double, turns it into a uh, side bolt, and he is down to six. While Influx down to ten, uh, but Influx blocked himself off from that vertical clear in column eight. Yeah, he's got that. He's got that yellow blue uh, virus set there in column eight. That's going to be a bit of a concern. Bit of a worry, and uh, Influx is kind of taking that slowdown into his advantage. He's down to four, gets the double down to two, down to one. He just has to clear those reds. And there it is, at a 740... Oh, wow, they finished... We the will game. need Influx. to review this. It we will need to review this. It looks unofficially like it was 746 for Influx... And dim it with a 748 or 749. We'll have to review it, but unofficially, it looked like Influx got it by a couple of seconds. We will we will double check that and verify it. Either way, though, that was a great job from both players. Doing a great job just keeping keeping up on those paces and just bringing it down to the wire. That was just a fantastic run from both of them. It is a definitive win for Influx. So Influx will uh, take the first game here and uh, has Dimwit behind the eight ball. Yeah, great win there for Influx. Taking it in the last couple of seconds. Going to give him the first game of the match. And we'll see if he can notch he can uh, notch it away and knock out the rain and champ in the game number two. We are just waiting on a ready from Influx, and we have it. All right, and in three, two, one, pills. We're going to be off for game number two between Dimwit and Influx. Dimwit. Need to win this in flocks on match point. Absolutely, and a uh, good start for both players as uh, it's going to be a quick little combo uh, for Dimwit, and uh, it looks to be a another combo. He's going to drop some blue garbage down, but has an opportunity to turn that into a horizontal uh, double. Isn't going to take it, uh, and it is 29-29 here, uh, early tie, 
as these players uh, looking to uh, get through eight as quickly as possible. And a nice combo there by Dimwit. And gets another zero flat clear um, on that on the right side there, looking to keep things going very quickly. Um, Influx now with the slight lean. He's got that blue garbage in column four, clears it away, and he's got himself another clean board. And you can see on the bottom, it's going to be mostly blue and red. It is mostly blue and red, and it's still pretty diverse for Dimwit. Uh, Dimwit, I think, really would like a uh, double blue, double red, or uh, rather double yellow uh, to maybe get that horizontal clear, and he is going to take it. Uh, good decision making there, I think, as uh, it will be a lot easier to get those double blues in the lower corner. Uh, an early lead here as Dimwood's starting to pull away just a touch. Yeah, Dimflux not far behind, though. He's going to take the double, get the uh, on that combo drop there, going to bring him down to 11. He's only down by three. In, uh, Dimwood with a great double, that's going to put him down to six. He's holding on to a 3-5 virus lead now. Uh, got a couple of blues to go and a couple of yellows. And Dimwit electing to take the drop time. Uh, and that means that it will be Influx getting out at a minute 44. And Dimwit just needing a, that double blue is huge out at a minute 52. Very, very close here in the second game, Ethan. Still very close right now. Going into level 9, the second level of this game. So it is still early, uh, too early to determine if someone's definitively got the lead right now. You can see, see the horizontal strats there from Dimwit. Good play. Great play there by Dimwit as he is at 34, but Influx already below 30. Uh, and he is looking to set up some more trouble here, looking for that double blue horizontal, and he will get it. And uh, now it is 28 to 24. Uh, clean board so far, and you see Dim Dimwit opening that board up with that clear in column three. Uh, meanwhile, most of Influx's viruses are on this bottom half of the board, uh, very clustered together. You've got a, a edge spire, which are just the worst. Yeah, the spire there in column one, with, and it's and even worse, it has that space there in the third row, which is going to make clearing those two blues on the bottom left a bit of a pain. But he's going to get a horizontal clear. Is he going to take it? Yes, he does. Going to open that up just a little bit. Influx down to eight. Dimwit at fifteen. Looks like he Big might have cross thought about combo there the by Dimwit. He's going to turn this into a quad. Oh, what a, what a great play there. And you see Dimwit starting to get aggressive. Oh, that might have been a misplay from Dimwit. He's starting to pile on a little and bit. You see the uh, look on Dimwit's face. I don't think he expected that. And now he's going to have to work around it. This gives Influx a golden opportunity. Influx down to six. And we're seeing uh, Dimwit looking to build... Uh, horizontally on those yellows, and he will get those uh, that horizontal clear, uh, and then he will additionally get another set of horizontals. Turns that into a combo down to two. Uh, Influx is buried on this uh, red virus in uh, column seven, Ethan. But he clears it up from the bottom and gets out at 353, and then went not far behind. He's got a 358 moving into level 10. Very, very close. Very exhilarating here as Dimwit looking to defend his championship. And Influx looking to get to uh, a semifinal here. He's He was a top four in the verses. We'd love to see him be a top four in speed as well. A cross clear by Dimwit down to 37. And uh, it appears that Influx at 33. Looking at these boards, Ethan, it looks to be a little bit more double friendly for Dimwit than it is Influx. Yeah, it's very dim uh, double friendly. You see there, you got that long double there on column seven. Uh, you know, he's just going to have to start filling space as best he can in order to, in order to make those doubles work with uh, with as little drop time as possible. It's a half a dozen viruses between these players. 29 to go uh, for, or now 28 for Dimwit, 22 for Influx. He'll get a zero drop double. He is now at 19, under 21st. Dimwit looking to clear his garbage now has a bit of a clean board, but really nowhere to play yellow at this point, Ethan. Yeah, doesn't have anything for yellow. If he can clear that red, he's going to clear that yellow underneath. That's a good play. But yeah, everything is surrounded by red and blue right now, so yellows are no bueno right now for Dimwit. And Dimwit is going to combo down that red in column one. 
Uh, it is 22 to 7. Influx starting to run away with this. Yeah, this is a big this is a big opportunity for Influx here. If he can knock down the number one seed, get himself into semifinal Sunday, he's got a shot, and I would say a pretty good shot of winning the whole thing as he moves into level eleven. And Influ watch this combo by Dimwit though. Dimwit not out here. Not by a long shot. He's going to get a double there on the left side. He's going to have to take care of the red. Oh, watch this three clear. There it goes. Oh, but a oh, misplay. Oh, no, no, that, is, that, is a, that is the right play. Oh, I see what he's, he's doing. Horizontal he's going clear. horizontal. He's going to combo out, out at a 6-10. Uh, but it is currently an 11 virus advantage and a, an extremely double-friendly board for Influx. Yeah, very friendly board right now, but it's all bunched on the right side. He's got nothing on the left. And uh, Dimwit has no red on his top line. That is his current issue as he is down to 37, looking to uh, stay alive in this tournament. And doing a good job finding a lot of twos and a lot of, uh, a lot of double clears. Dimwit very quietly aggressive right now, uh, just trying to get back into this game. He's got to catch up to Influx, or he's got to hope a mistake comes off of Influx's side. Uh, otherwise, uh, it may be Influx running Oh, there it this. is! There's that misplay! That yellow-blue got misflipped! Well, there's the commentator's curse for you, folks. But look at him clean it up so beautifully. Gets the lightning bolt, and it's almost like it never even happened. Meanwhile, Dimwit needing yellow help. Double blue would be incredibly helpful for him. He's going to get this uh, side bolt here really nicely done. He's down to 14. Here we go, folks. These players both down to the nitty-gritty. Uh, it just It's just four reds for Influx, and he will take down the champ. There they are. He's going to get, gonna get this, right and one. Influx has upset. Influx upsetting Dimwit, and we will have a new speed champion in 2021. Wow. And looks like uh, Dimwit's going to try to finish this off with a hot dog fat log. No, nope, he's just going to go ahead and just take the uh, take the take the other horizontal way. But look at how many lack of reds are popping in here. Just absolutely a brutal match there uh, for Dimwit. Brutal orange. Influx will be advancing to the top four, and that's good news for him. And we'll talk about that a little later. Uh, but when we come back, our next second round match. Ethan and Savage Octagon will be bringing you Leviticus versus Floyd, the rematch. These two met in the 2020 championship in round two. They're doing it again. We'll see what happens there. Don't go anywhere, folks. We'll be back. <laughs> 